Guys, I'm pretty much going to show you today how to properly put fix a flat. I don't know if you can see it. Fix a flat into your tire. Now, this is possibly tire sensor safe. I can't say it with 100% sure, but it says it right there on the bottle. I ain't got tire sensors. I don't think I have ever owned a vehicle had tire sensors, but I have worked on many of the vehicle with tire sensors, but I never had to use this stuff in it. But I have used this stuff before, and it does do okay. It's, it's iffy. It's a 50-50 shot if it might fix your leak enough to get you somewhere safe. But it will not permanently fix it. I can say that with 100% fact. But it might fix it for a couple days, or fix it long enough to get a tire for your car. Or truck. So... The video I shot was pretty late because the truck behind me, the tire is leaking around the thread. The tire is dry rotted. It's starting to. It's getting threads about well. Like I said, 22 inch rims go on this, so. Just ain't had time to put them on. We just needed something to get by a few more days till we get them, so. Fix a flat it was. Now, let's check it out, see if it held out. Okay guys, this is a little late video. As you can see, we have a bad tire leak here. I'm going to show you how to actually do the fix a flat type deal. Well, uh, here's the instructions. I don't know if you guys can pretty well see this. It's night time. For best results, move car flatly so that the puncture is in the 6 o'clock position. So, you know, a puncture, we ain't got one. We actually got a little bit of leaking around the dreads. This tire is dry watered a little. So hold can up right, push button down firmly. Do not shake can while hose is attached to valve stem. Only when product stops moving, release button. Make sure tire rim lifts off the ground. Only if rim is on the ground, drive vehicle immediately at a short distance to allow tire pressure to increase. So the sealant will spread evenly. Air up to more pressure if needed. Have tire repaired by a professional within three days or a hundred miles. So we need to shake this up for 30 seconds. Next step will be to remove your valve stem. We done did on this guy. Take your fixer flat, screw it on the valve stem. Just like so. Turn the can upside down. Like so, and mash the button. Don't shake the can while doing it. Just let the fix a flat fill the tire. And you pretty much put the whole can in it. Pretty much to the white stuff quit coming out. The foam. If my shoulder can hold up. Okay, pretty well got this filled up. Now we are going to drive on this tire. It ain't super low, but it is low. And with the uh, fixer flat, get hot with the tire as the pressure builds up and has its time to find the leak wherever it's leaking, hit a coat this whole tire and seal the leak. So let's put a cap back on. And take it for a drive. And in the morning, if it ain't went flat, we know it worked. Okay, here it is the next day. Pretty much, as you can see, it still looks a little low. But I ain't never put no more air into it besides what we already had. It does not look like it's leaked off any. So, I guess fix the flat. Did fix the leak. So it should get me around a couple more days till I get the 22 inch tires and wheels put over onto the truck. 
Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video on pretty much how to put fix flat in your car and truck. Now, uh, when you do put it in, remember to drive on it for at least uh, three miles or longer to, you know, get the fix flat mixed up pretty good. Now, when you do got a flat, you want to put the fix flat in it just enough to up a little, drive a short way, and then add air. This tire, we didn't have to add no air to it. Um, but yours may be different. It might be completely flat. So, that'll be something to, uh, you know, look for. Now, uh, thank you for checking out this video. And if you ain't checked my channel out, check my channel out for more daily content. And uh, also check it out for more videos. There's tons of different videos, different content. Might be something you enjoy. And until next time, I'll see you then. Take care. Bye-bye now.